Hello students, it is Miss Nemeth here once again to talk to you about cadences. So cadences are what we use at the end of musical sentences. Similar to punctuation, it what's what lets us know that we're at the end of the thought or the musical thought. So there are three different types of cadences that we will be talking about today. The first one is called an authentic cadence. This is also sometimes referred to as a perfect authentic cadence. So it's where we go from our dominant function or our five chord to our tonic function. The difference between a perfect and an imperfect uh, authentic cadence has to do with how we arrange the notes, but we don't really need to know that right now. So again, first type, authentic. Five to one. Our second type that we're going to be dealing with is a half cadence. This is almost like a question mark or an ellipsis. It lets us know that while this thought is done, there is still something that's coming. So we usually put it in the middle of our um, musical thoughts, kind of like in the middle of a paragraph. And it's where we go from one to five. So um, if you go back to some of my other videos, you'll watch when uh, I play Can't Help Falling In Love With You. Um, there's, uh, in the middle, it goes from one to five, and then we go back to the four, the And so that's what makes the music flow and have movement and momentum. If you've watched the video about tension already, you'll know that this is a way we create tension. So. The last type of cadence we're going to be talking about today is called a deceptive cadence. It's where we go from five to six. And we call it a deceptive cadence because it's not what our ears are expecting to hear. We want to hear an authentic cadence. That return back to the tonic and back to home. But unfortunately, that's not what we get. So we get our deceptive cadence of five to six. So all three of those play back to back. We'll start with our authentic cadence, five, one. Next, our half cadence, one, five. And lastly, our deceptive cadence, five, six. So these are the three types of cadences that we will be dealing with in music class from now on. Uh, until next time, I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.